Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, make sure to hit the subscribe button and stick around. My name is Mackenzie and I would love to have you guys join the fun. I post tons of different try on hauls and college videos here on my channel. And today is actually going to be, I think, my last video it, with this background here in Ohio, I am getting ready to move out and back home um, and then off to California. So you're going to be seeing quite a few background shifts. I hope that you guys are okay with that. Um, today I've got a huge summer haul with a zaffle. I've got some fun suits, some dresses, and some cutie tops for the upcoming months. I'm super excited to be somewhere where the weather is nice, warm, and sunny all the time. And I thought that this would be a good way to kind of hop into that. As per usual, I will leave links to everything down below so that you guys can shop and I will leave my coupon code here on the screen and the description bar so that you guys can save some money on your next purchase. Without further ado, let's hop right on in. All right, I am going to go ahead and hop right in with a few swimsuits. I only have five or six swimsuits to share with you guys today. Typically, I would say that the quality of swimsuits from Zaffle is a little bit better than Shein and the quality of clothes is a little bit less than Shein. Um, kind of a good rule of thumb. But the first bathing suit that I got just looks like this. It is a green ribbed material with the cutest little rings along the sides the back of it is rather cheeky and it's got that ruched back which I really love it helps give your booty a little bit of a mm, little bit of plump and I really like these bottoms they have a really good width to the bottom of them and I just felt like they were very flattering as for the top it just looks like this this does have removable straps so you can wear this strapless if you prefer it's got that adorable ring detail that you guys know I love so much and it does have two clasps along the back so if you're looking for a little bit more support this is definitely going to kind of hold you in place and give you a little bit more security there the next bathing suit I have is your typical string bikini bottoms just look like this they've got a mix of orange purple and pink so I really love the little color blocking moment mix of pastels they do self tie along the sides Don't forget to double knot in case one of your knots comes undone you've got a backup plan these are the kind of bottoms that cinch along that lower band so you can really make these as cheeky or as full coverage as you want I really love this style. I find them to be very flattering. They are also a great bathing suit if you are just looking to lay out and tan in. The top looks like this. It's got that three piece. You've got two cups. And I really like Zaffle bathing suits because their triangle tops tend to be a little bit wider in coverage. They cover a little bit more of your boob and they spread out a little bit more. Of course, they do still move along that lower band. So if you want to cinch them up really small, you can. It does self tie along the neck and around the back. And just overall, very, very flattering suit. Next one I grabbed, I absolutely love the color of. It's like this light blue with some big flowers on it in another blue. I really like triangle style tops, but I will say I prefer the style that I just showed you as opposed to these. As you can see, this has like adjustable straps back here and it doesn't self tie around the neck. I find that these move around a little bit more. They're not the best suits if you are looking to dive under waves and just really play in the water because they do move around a little bit more. Still very cute, but um, not necessarily the most functional swimsuit. And then the bottoms to this guy just look like this. They are super high cut and they sit very high up on the hips. So they're going to really elongate those legs and slim down that torso. They do run a little bit big. So if you are in between sizes, I would definitely say go down. This next bathing suit has such a cool print to it. I've never seen anything like this. Very unique. And it's got those ribbed bottoms. They have a raw cut. They sit very high up on the hips. They're cheeky along the back. This is a very standard style for Zaffle. You'll see a lot of these kinds of suits. They really do help elongate the legs. And I just find them to be a never fail great tan line um, super functional in the water because they're not going to move around a ton as for the top this is one of those that kind of wraps around like this and then it goes around the neck for more of that halter style I've been seeing a lot of these tops recently they are incredibly sexy they're super fun I'm not gonna lie it's not necessarily the tan line that I desire but I do think that it's a very fun suit All right, next bikini has got the coolest color palette to it I really love the mix of like green yellow orange we've got going on here and this is also a very unique style it's like two pieces of fabric and then there's ties that go around the torso as well but you still have adjustable straps and then it ties around the back so very unique very different um, definitely gives your boobs a little bit of oomph if you are on the larger chest side I would say skip out on this it doesn't really have any type of support to it and with all those self ties it is going to move around a little bit more than your average top as for the bottom 
bottoms. They just look like this and are your standard little tie side bathing suit bottoms. They're a little bit skimpier in the front than some of the other ones, but um, still a cute style. Okay, and then this next suit I really wanted to love. I think the pattern of it is super cute. It's like a light pink with baby little flowers on it. The bottoms are really cute. They're more of that diaper style that cinch up really small. Definitely like minimal coverage in the coochie area. The top, however, um, literally did not fit me. It's very rare that tops don't fit me. I don't have super big boobs. I'm about a 34B in the chest and I typically wear an extra small or a small in their bathing suits. But this I like literally couldn't get, like it barely covered my boobs. Like my nipple was like bursting at the seams, so I didn't even try this on for you guys. I would just say skip out on this in general, it wasn't my fave. All right, we're gonna move on in to dresses. I've picked up tons of super cute sundresses, some middies, a couple of two pieces that are just gonna be perfect for the upcoming months. I did not go ahead and steam anything in this video because I wanted to show you guys the way that some of these materials wrinkle. This for me is the biggest quality difference between Zaffle and other retailers that I shop from is that they they all have a mix of polyester to them so they wrinkle super super quickly but I still love a lot of their styles some of them are definitely like very cheap quality you're getting what you pay for but keep in mind you are paying 10 15 dollars for your dress this was definitely my favorite piece from this entire haul I have been loving this shade of green as you can tell I have it on right now I'm gonna talk about this top in a, a little bit but I love this style dress it's more of a baby doll fit but it's got the sweetest neckline to it so incredibly flattering I don't have a bra on with this and as you can see it kind of just gives you a little bit of cleavage it's got puff sleeves it's the right length I think that this could be cute for so many different occasions this time of year little first date moments little anniversary winery you name it I think that this is adorable and as you can see it's more of like that synthetic -y polyester um, whereas some of the other ones are gonna be more of a linen which I'll show you later next dress I got is an olive green maxi and this is so incredibly flattering it's got a a long slit along the left hand side of it so it really does accentuate the figure really gives you some curves I'm not an overly curvy girl and I feel like this really did give me a little bit of something something really makes your butt look good too the top of it's just got a very classic neckline I mean straight across we've got some elastic straps right here nothing super special to this I do feel like it's the kind of dress that you can easily dress up or down. You could wear this with sandals and kind of keep things casual or you could pop on a pair of heels and dress it up for dinner out. I do believe this comes in a few different colors and it was one of my faves from the haul. If you know me, you know I am a sucker for anything with ruched cups. I really, really love that detail. It's super cute, very feminine. And I have two dresses that are the same style. This first one is more of that synthetic -y material and then this one is more of like that linen. And you can kind of see that as I hold them up. First one is just like a teal with a little bit of dainty floral throughout. I love this dress. Everything about this style I just feel like is very flattering. You can easily throw these on with a pair of sandals. Again, the kind of style that works for church, brunch, um, hanging out with friends, like you name it. I love this kind of dress in the summer, super easy to throw on. It's just the right length on me. I'm about 5'2", five, 5'3", five, and it does have self-tying straps, which I love. You can kind of cater that towards your chest size, whatever it may be. And then, like I said, I did pick up that same style just in this light blue linen. This one is so wrinkly. This is like the best way to describe this material. It wrinkles super, super quickly. One of those things that even when you steam and you sit down in it, it is going to have a little bit of wrinkle to it. But I love this material for the fact that it's super breathable, like very airy. If it's a hot summer day, something like this is really going to keep you cool. I'm obsessed. How cute are those little tie straps? Okay, next dress I got I think would be perfect for church on a Sunday with just like a pair of sandals. It is more of a midi style and I wasn't really expecting to like this dress but it kind of reminds me of something like um, the main character would wear in a Nicholas Sparks movie. It's just like very cutesy, very feminine. It's more of that synthetic -y material and it's got um, a little bit of floral to it. A lot of the things I picked up were floral because obviously it's spring and summer now. It's got light little puff sleeves and a few buttons down the front um, it's a midi style and it's got just a baby slit to it I don't know I thought this was very cute it's a very simple design and yet I really loved Next it dress I have is also a midi it's a blue and brown gingham so fun it's got a very unique like little crisscross along the front and then a cut out along the stomach I love this I don't know like it was very different than anything else I have in my closet very unique style to it but I liked it 
I also picked up this dress. It is so, so thin, like literally the thinnest piece of fabric, but it's adorable. I love this color palette. It's a mix of blue, green, and pink. Super cute. It's got that straight across neckline, thin adjustable straps, and then a fun little cutout along the sides. I do believe that this is a dupe for a specific dress, but I'm not sure. I can't remember where the original dress is from. If I can find it, I'll leave it on the screen, but super cutesy just with a pair of sandals. All right, the next dress I have is another linen-y material very thin as you can see this is like super like on the see-through side not my favorite dress the quality of this is really nothing special I really wanted to love this but the sizing was a little bit off it kind of fits as if it's like a halter tank top and a skirt but they are connected by like a couple of stitches right there the skirt was a little big on me and the top didn't necessarily do anything for me so I'm not a huge fan I do really love the color and I wanted to like this style I just felt like it it didn't do anything. I do have two dresses in this jersey material. I have quite a few pieces in this, both from White Fox Boutique and from Zaffel. I love it. It's one of my favorite materials. It's incredibly flattering and a little more like sexy if you're looking for a formal dress. Um, a sorority function like something like that this material is a never fail this is the same pink as the last dress so I'm really glad that this was a hit it's got a cowl neckline and it's just like a midi style it's got a slit along the side to kind of dress it up a little bit and it hugs your butt beautifully it's not the thickest material in the world so I would still do nude underwear and a sticky bra with this but I love this style um, wedding guest kind of moment is this material I do believe it comes in a few other colors too that are probably a little more fitting for the occasion all right, and then the next dress I got, I actually have a dress in this exact style. It's black, and I wore it to my sorority semi-formal, and I loved it. I got so many compliments on it, so I picked up this dress in the green, that same jersey material. This olive green color is one of the most flattering on me. I have really deep olive undertones, so I feel like this is super flattering. This kind of fits like a like triangle bikini up top. There's a little cutout to it, and then it's just like your classic mini dress very cute for a sorority date party i can't imagine really wearing this anywhere besides like clubbing out or to a date party but i love the style i feel like it's one of the most flattering and then i did go ahead and pick up two different two-piece sets this first one i absolutely love the color palette of it's like so bright warm and happy i love it more of a midi style kind of hits mid shin just like a couple of tiered ruffles and it does have a stretchy elastic waistband i prefer for all bottoms to be elastic waistbands when I buy them from um, a retailer like Zaffle just because their sizing can be a little tricky. I have a smaller waist. I'm about a 25 inch in the waist. So this extra small with the elastic was perfect on me. And then the top just looks like this. A cutie little strapless top. It crisscrosses along the front and then it's got a ruched back to it. I love this. So fun, so flattering. You could obviously wear these pieces together or separate. I think with just a pair of denim shorts that this could be a moment. All right, and then the next two piece set I got is a tiered little mini skirt. So not a midi, just a mini, and it's got a couple of different ruffles. During my quarantine days, I wore stuff like this literally 24 seven, cutesy little elastic waistband. I love the gingham, perfect for a little picnic date in the park. And then the top is the exact same as that last two piece set, twists along the front. We've got that smock detail on the back. Again, it could be very cute with just a pair of white jeans and sandals if you wanted to mix and match. I love two piece sets for that reason. You really do get um, three outfits for the price of one. Alright, I know I had a dress in this same material pattern earlier. I loved the dress, but this top, alright, first of all, it's that same super flimsy cheap material, but just, just like everything about it, the quality is not that good. It doesn't really fit me right, it runs a little big, the straps are long, just not my fave. It looks super cute, just Personally, not my fave top. And then the last thing that I got is actually this olive green top that I have on right now. I was not expecting to like this as much as I do, but everything about this color has just been speaking to me. It's got a cute little ring along the center, and then it just goes out like this. However, there's a little bit of elastic right here, so you don't run the risk of this like blowing up and totally exposing your boobs. Um, I think that's super cute. You could obviously wear this out, or you could just make this work for like lunch with friends too. So very versatile, but... Yeah, that is going to be everything for today's haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing some Zaffle pieces. I know it's been a while since I shared some pieces from them. If you guys want to see a part two to this video, be sure to give this one two thumbs up and I will get working on that. Love you guys and I will talk to you very, very soon.